Hello, Abiodu Jubaro. Welcome to another edition of our solar tutorials. In this video, I'll be sharing with you one of the common mistakes during battery and inverter connection. And what is it all about? Every inverter has what we call the DC input voltage. The DC input voltage is very important while you are connecting your inverter to your battery. So the input voltage, for example, of this inverter in front of me is 24 volts. What does that imply? This implies that at least I need two batteries connected in series. That is 12 volt plus 12 volt in series, that's 24 before this inverter can work effectively. If I connect this inverter, which is a 24 volt inverter to a 12 volt battery, this inverter will not pick up. I mean, this inverter will not uh, function because it's not designed to work with 12 volt. So the inverter is designed to work with a 24 volt system. Take it note again, I call it the DC input voltage of the inverter. So anytime you have uh, planning to connect an inverter to a battery, it is very important for you to check the DC input voltage of that inverter. So, for instance, if an inverter says um, is written on its data sheet that the DC input voltage is 48, this implies that you need at least four batteries connected in series before you can power on the inverter. So if you like this video, kindly subscribe to our channel. You can like and share this video. Thank you.